everything has a rhythm and a routine. In the known universe, everything, all the animals have a rhythm and a routine, all of it. The whole universe runs on a rhythm. And of course, the further away we get from a daily rhythm and a routine, the more unhappy we get, the more unplugged we get. And I don't mean unplugged in a, as in a good way, which is unplugging from tech, but I mean more unplugged from our natural body rhythms. So waking up at about the same time is important. You know, wake up at about six-ish every day, do your exercise at about the same time, have your three meals at about the same time, go to bed at about the same time. You know, if you start to get into that kind of routine and rhythm, your body regulates. And then you start to get better bowel motions too. And of course, bowel motions, the regularity of three bowel motions comes from three meals with enough insoluble fiber, which grabs the waste and removes it, which means your microbiome can rebuild and give you good genetic expression, which gives you healthy longevity. You know, so, so much of about it is initially willpower. And that's hard because sometimes, you know, people want a pill. And I used to be in the health industry for years, you know, for a long time I was in the health industry. And what I noticed when you're in the health industry is there's always another potion coming out every year. This is the latest new thing, the new potion for this or for that, or the new multivitamin or the new superfood or whatever. None of that matters and none of that works unless it's on top of the basics done well. You know, you can't take a pill to stop you from sleeping or replace sleep. You can't. Sleep is sleep. It can't be replaced with meditation or with anything. Meditation's great, don't get me wrong. It just doesn't replace sleep. So a rhythm and a routine is really important to having a daily rhythm, a daily routine around when you wake, when you exercise, when you eat, when you sleep.